Hello everyone. Um you're probably like we're waiting for this finally. Um I am finally making part 46 of Ocarina of Time. Now, I know guys this took a long time and stuff. I had I had um just too lazy to set it up and get here and stuff, get where I was last time. But as you can see, it's like a way different view, and it's kind of dumb. So hold on a second. There I am. Um, I'm out in my room, and uh, why you're thinking it's a different uh, view is because I got this new TV in my room, and guess in it's like a flat screen stuff. So. I, I, you're gonna have to deal with it. I'm sorry. Um, alright, so, in the last episode, we got here where I was when I just began this video, um, started this video. Um, and you'll get a small key if you watch the last episode. And, alright. Listen. <laughs> this guy is so freaking hard. He is one of the most defensive mini bosses in the world. I'm not kidding. All right, trick is back and then slice, back slice. But if he cuts the pillars, you'll get a bunch of parts. See. I haven't played uh, Zelda games in a long time, so. Oh God. Uh, here's the trick. You wanna use Nehru's love. Oh yeah. And you'll be and you'll be um, extra defensive and you don't need to worry about this and you and the bad thing is when you're using this you can't use spin attacks you only can use these small ones alright we did it and then when you beat it it leaves like it leaves three hearts Instead of like six, it's even a level like left like seven or six. Like, seriously, all right, go out this room and guess what? We finished Spirit Temple Child. And look, there he is, the stupid owl. He's like still here. Yep, um, if you can't really see that well. I am gonna turn the light on real quick. I know, I can't even see that well. Probably because it's nighttime in my game. Now that's even worse. Yeah, it's probably because it's nighttime. No, even if you don't know what he said, still say no. It's all crap, y'all know. You don't need him, you just have me. And you have, um, you have Zelda Dungeon, you have me, you have, um, other guys, you have a bunch of less players. You don't need that stupid owl. If you open this treasure chest, you'll get the silver gauntlets, and you can't fit them in your arms when you're a child. But when you're an adult, you can. Alright, what's happening here? Oh, uh, screams. What's happening? Hey, where are you tank ta taking me? I was about to say tanking. Yarg, let me go. What? The? Witches! You, you fiends, Gandor's minions. Hey, N Naboru. Link, get, get out of here now. These witches, they're using black magic on me. 
<laughs> Get back in the spirit temple. I'll take care of you later. Look at that. He's just looking down. He's like, what the frick? Alright. Now, once you finish spirit temple adult, as you can see, there's a heart piece over there that I'm going to try to boomerang over here. Let's see if I, uh, you can boomerang heart pieces, but it's kind of, it's going to be kind of hard. Because, um, of course you need to get as close as you can. There, it's night time. You can probably see better now. Uh -huh. What if you want that heart piece, you um should plant the magic bean as you can see there's like a magic bean right there. And um I'm gonna sit in my offer and play Prelude of Light. Just warp here with Prelude Warp to Temple of Time. All right, we're in Temple of Time. And go up to the Master Sword. What the frick? Did you see my magic power? There's like a yellow thing right there. And it's not even... What the frick? All right. We are adults. Dot bank. See, look, it's yellow. All right, and then you work. You work to Desert Colossus, and as you can see, you have silver gauntlets on. You have to finish Child Spirit Temple first. Okay? Alright, so get in the Spirit Temple. You need the Silver Gauntlets. And you actually get to uh, keep these gauntlets, which is a pretty awesome thing. And as you can see, you couldn't push this block before. But when you get the silver gauntlets, you can, because you can feel, like, the power in your arms, and it really gets tough and stuff, so. Alright, so push that, and it'll fall into that hole. I'm gonna try this time. Let's try this. Oh, yes, I made it! And then you get this switch on top. And that door opens. Go through the door. Um, uh, oh, Wolfo, Wolfo, <laughs> easy. Plays out as all by here. Seriously, I haven't played Zelda in a really long time. I played Pokemon, um, a lot. And then, what you want to do, if you're, like, wondering how to get over to that treasure, just hook shot or long shot or whatever you guys call it hook shot grapple long shot or chain hook i don't even know and you get the compass yes the compass and then you can just quickly grapple over there and go through the door um Oh god. Not fall for that crap. Go through this door and you'll see there's a, it's the white rupee game again. Um it's really easy. I told you a bunch of times how to do this and stuff. All you need to do is just collect all these rupees, the white ones. And be careful, there are giant rocks around here once i get ocarina of time 3d i'm gonna 
um, oh, whoops, make a walkthrough of that, too. I do not have a 3DS yet. I never laid my hands on one. Never in my life. I I never laid my... Oh, look, it's Victoria. Alright. We got another token. Why don't we see how much Skatulas we have? 24, that's not that much. I don't know why I just like don't have that much. And I know where a bunch of Skatulas are, but in my from previous file, I had a lot of Skatulas at this point. I have like a lot, a lot, a lot. A latte. And I forget how to get that. Oh. Oh, I get it now. What you want to do to get this one is go like all the way back here so the boulders don't hurt you. Hook shot. And you can hook shot through it. And then you can just go like that. Um, I forgot how to do that. And get through this. Come on, go, Link. Yes. All right. Um, you'll see. Oh God! Like, like. All right. We finished that. Like, like. And leave anything? A uh, couple more things. And open the chest, and we get a small key. Yay! All right. So that's practically all you get in this room. So after you get that small key, you just leave. Ah, oh, God. F. All right, climb. Get through the door. And you'll see a locked door. Go through it. A like like will pop up so watch out I actually got that like uh, right when it came to me yes. All right more emerald walkthroughs are coming up um I up already upload um, episode 12 and episode 11 so yeah um I, I don't know if I'm gonna make any more emerald walkthroughs today but I need uh, well, I only, like, made one. Oh, oh crap, oh crap. Watch out for this guy. He's, uh, a floor, ma a floor master. There will be, like, two around here. I love that sound. <laughs> ah, God. Spirit Temple's most annoying, most annoying enemy. Wall floor masters. Just leave me alone. What? Yeah? All right. Guys, so I guess I have to end the video here, so I'll see you guys later. Bye.